guys, back with another video. Finished Tottenham Hotspur 2, Aston Villa 1. Uh, great result. Great result with the boys. Um, thought we played really, really well. Uh, especially the full-backs. Thought they were brilliant up and down. Uh, yeah, it was just great. Uh, moving into the uh, international breaks again. Fucking load of shit that is. Uh, puts it in good stead running a um, couple of points now from off the big boys, basically. So, uh, yeah, no, it was good, good, good result, like I said. Uh, for Son Him Min had a very, very good game. He looked lively and fit, which is great news for us. Obviously, getting an international break, though, uh, we, we need him protected for when we come back. I think our first game back to Newcastle United, so. We need to kick on there, beat them, and then we've got uh, a London derby coming up. So, uh, another one. Uh, other than that, let's, let's, let's talk about the game. I thought, uh, I thought the right back was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, Emerson Royal uh, showed his qualities going forward and defensively. It's the uh, first real good game I've seen him play, to be fair. I thought Hoiberg was fantastic in midfield. Um, Romero at the back made Dyer look very, very good as well, which is uh, a rare even me to say, but very, very solid. I thought Romero was brilliant on the ball. Really is composed. Um, gives us another dimension. But um, midfield for me, again, Oliver Skip. Every time this geezer plays, he impresses me. Um, I think he's a fantastic player. He's definitely a future England player. There's no doubt, doubt about it for me. Uh, it won't be long. But uh, he looks so in front for his age, you know. He looks looks vastly... He's advanced for his age. Let's just put it that way. Uh, very good midfielder. And, uh, yeah, like I said, when he was with Hoiberg in there, he was pretty solid. Disappointed than Dunbelly again. Uh, doesn't do enough. I just think he's a lazy player. Very, very lazy player. I've said it before. He's just lazy. Uh, don't want to know. Um, but like I said, after we got pegged back, we went a goal up, obviously, with Weberg. Fantastic movie. Started it off, finished it. Brilliant finish. Um, especially for a defensive midfielder. Great, great finish. Um, then they pegged us back 1 0. Holly uh, Watkins. Same old story. I thought, here we go again. But lovely, lovely bit of work down the wind from uh, Son. Absolutely ruining Matty Cash like he did all day. And uh, squares it for more to tap him, but Target just gets a foot on it and diverts it into his own net before Mora can get the touch. I'll take it. I don't care how, how we get the win. It's a win. It's three points. It moves us up the table, moves us above the uh, right of rival teams, I should say. Moves us above them and puts us in good stead. Like I said, uh, it's only a few points separating us from um, second in the league. But uh, not, not that we're going to win the league, obviously. I don't ever say we're going to win the league. But like I said, yeah, I'd be nice. I'd be happy with a top five finish. I'd obviously I want top four, but I'd be happy with a top five finish this season. And like I say every year, want to win a cup. But uh, I just want to dedicate this video as well. Um, to the memory of one of my best mates, brother, and a friend of mine also, Paul Linger. Um, one of my best mates, Daniel. We grew up together, obviously. And uh, yeah, I just want to put a message out for Paul who lost his life a couple of days ago. Um, it's a pancreatic cancer, and it's just, just, just been really, really sad. Um, so I'm dedicating this video to to the memory of uh, Paul Linger. Rest in peace, mate. Um, you're not in any pain anymore, mate. And you can go and kick as much ball up in here as you want. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself, mate. But very, very sad. And um, my thoughts and prayers with Daniel, Natalie, Helen, Mike, and uh, especially his kids as well, Frankie and... Yeah, it's just sad, it's just sad, but, you know, uh, 
Rest in peace, Paul. Rest in peace, mate. Uh, on to the next video. Come on, you Spurs.